Hey everybody! For Happy Halloween! And no, I'm not dressed up as something scary, I'm just hungover as always. Not as always, I don't drink always, but whenever I make a video I seem to be hungover, I have no idea why. So I'd like to start right away. Um, we left off at the fact that in Swiss German you have two different ways of forming the past. Either you use to have or you use to be as a, I think it's a modal verb, auxiliary verb. One of those. Uh, auxiliary verb, yeah. So in this video I'm going to name the past forms or the past participle forms of all the verbs which are conjugated with to have. Well, all, all the important ones. Um, and I'll start right away. I saw would be I ha xe. Xe to forget would be or uh, I forgot would be Ich ha vergesse. Vergesse. Uh, I had to. Ich ha müsse. Müsse. And by the way, you can say ich han or ich ha. It usually depends on your um, dialect. And also, yeah, sorry that I'm interrupting, kind of digressing, but um, a lot of people told me, well, Swiss German people who watch my videos told me that I should point out that we have a like a variety of dialects and I think I've said that in or mentioned that in some of my videos but I'll say it again the way I speak that's the dialect of a city in Zurich in the canton Zurich so it's not even the dialect well it is mostly the dialect that they speak in Zurich city but I also have some words which I say uh, in my dialect like for example when I say need instead of nerd which means not so I would say need and others would say nerd, some would say no, and yeah, so it really it kind of differs, but we, still, we can understand each other, so it doesn't matter if you say need or nerd or no or whatever, people will, will still understand you. So it doesn't matter if you say ich han or ich ha or even iha, which I sometimes say as well, um, it's the same, so which, whichever is easier for you. So yes, uh, I had to is ich ha müsse, müsse. I gave. Ich ha ge, ge. I could, uh, I was able to. Ich ha könne, könne, könne. I had, or I have had. Ich ha ka, ich ha ka. I slept. I ha geschlafen, geschlafen. I read. I ha gläse, gläse. I wrote. I ha geschrieben, geschrieben. I ate. I ha gesse, gesse. Uh, I took. I ha kno, kno. I found. I ha gfunde, gfunde. I said. I ha gseit, gseit. I understood. I ha verstande, verstande. I looked for or I searched. I ha gsucht, gsucht. Um, I needed. I ha brucht, brucht. I did or I made. I ha gemacht, gemacht. To feel or well felt. I ha gefühlt, gefühlt. I believed. I ha glaubt, glaubt. I thought. I ha denkt, denkt. I knew. I ha gewusst. Gewusst. I learned. I ha gelernt. Gelernt. I heard. I ha gehört. Gehört. I kissed. I ha küsst. Küsst. And here's the thing with to laugh, with to cook and with to listen. Um, well, I listened, I cooked or I laughed. There are two forms. So you can either say I ha glachet, glachet, or I ha glacht. 
ich habe gekocht, oh, I cooked, or ich habe gekocht, 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 or ich habe gelöst, ich habe gelöst, that's, uh, I listen to, I listen to, gelöst, gelöst, so yeah, you can choose whichever, I think I use them both, I don't even know when I use which one, because it's just, you can interchange them, doesn't matter, I waited, ich habe gewartet, I asked, ich habe gefragt. I showed. Ich habe gezeigt. Ich habe gezeigt. Ich habe gezeigt. See, that's the thing. Even with those, I didn't even notice until now. You can say, ich habe gezeigt. Or, ich habe gezeigt. Ich habe gefragt. Ich habe gefragt. Both words. I called. If you call somebody. Ich habe angerufen. Angerufen. Um, and those are the most important ones. If you can think of some verb that I did not mention and you really, really need the past form, then you can, of course, as always, you can just leave me a comment. And something else I wanted to talk about is that you know that I said we have a present progressive, where, um, same as in English, if you say, I am eating, we say, ich bin am essen. Well, somebody asked me what's with I was eating. And of course, it exists too. As you already know how to form I am eating, and you also know how to say I was. I was is ich bin xi, and I am eating is ich bin am esse. So if you want to say I was eating, you would say ich bin am esse xi. So I am eating was. I was eating. <laughs> ich bin am esse xi. Ich bin am koche xi. Ich bin am gumpe xi. So if you still have questions about that, uh, leave them in the comments, write me a private message. And also, um, a couple of weeks ago, Jamie, that's one of you subscribers or viewers, she um, posted a video response saying something in Swiss German so that I could tell her what it sounded like. And I really liked the idea. So I was thinking if you guys want me to check your Swiss German at some point, you don't have to do it at all, it's just, it's a suggestion. If you are not sure how to say a word or if you're saying it right, you can post the video, um, you don't even have to show your face, and then just talk and I will tell you what's wrong or what you're doing really well, and yeah. And that's it for today, I think this video is probably really long, I hate long videos. <laughs> Bye guys! I do in no way condone drinking.